Yo! In today's video, we're going to be showing you the best skins for every brawler in Brawl Stars. Please like and subscribe. Yeah, boy. Let's hop right into it. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. Let's hop into showing you guys the best skins for every single brawler inside of the Brawl Stars game. If you guys disagree with me, I feel ba very bad for you because these skins either have really cool effects or just overall look insane, guys. Let's hop right into the video. We're going to be starting from top brawler to bottom brawler. Let's get it. We're going to be starting with, you know who it is, Shelly. Iperibre. The best skin for Shelly shouldn't have too much arguments about. There are a couple other ones that have cool effects, but this one has the best winning and losing animations for Shelly skins, and it has awesome uh, shooting effects. The best skin for Shelly is going to be... Drumroll, please. Which Shelly? This skin is absolutely insane. Definitely one of my favorite skins inside of the game. Um, there's no doubt about that one, guys. The next brawler we're going to be telling you guys the best skin for is Nita. She is the first one on Trophy Road, and she is a very, very good brawler. I recommend you getting her ranked up, but let's show you guys the best skin for her. The best skin for Nita by far is going to be Sheba Nita. When placing down Nita's bear, it has a cool bone under the bear, and so it looks really cool, which is why it's called a Sheba Nita. The next brawler is going to be Colt. Colt's best skin is going to be Royal Agent Colt. His, he is definitely the best Colt skin because he has awesome effects that when, he, when he's shooting his bullets, they are super awesome coins. The next brawler is going to be the Bull Headshot. <laughs> the best skin for Bull would be Barbarian King Bull, but it is free. And so the best skin for Bull is going to be Red Linebacker Bull. There are a couple reasons why this is the best skin. One, it's really red and cool. Two, its gun is literally a football. And three, it really is just an awesome skin overall. And there was in it went to the archive, so it's OG. Next brawler is going to be Jesse. The skin that I chose might confuse you guys and you guys might disagree, and I'm sorry. I was thinking about putting Tanuki Jesse as the best Jesse skin, but because of how ugly it kind of looks, I went I didn't do that, and so I decided to do for the best Jesse skin, um, Dark Dragonite Jesse. The skin has a custom face that looks mad. It also has custom shots that look absolutely awesome, and an awesome dragon turret. The next skin we're going to be going over that is the best for the boy, the man, the myth, the legend, Barack Obama. Yes. The best Brock skin was also debatable, but it was definitely Beach Brock because it looks the coolest. It has one of the best effects in the game, and the shots sound so awesome when the water hits. The next brawler we're going to do is Dynamite. I'm on a sharp use. The best Dynamite skin is definitely going to be Robo Mike because it has a custom voice. It looks awesome because the bird is controlling the Robo Mike and the shots look really awesome. The next brawler we're going to do is Bo. I fight for peace. The best Bo skin is going to be Horus Bo because of its awesome effects with its winning and losing animations and its awesome shots that he literally shoots lightning bolts. It's definitely the best skin for Bo. All right, next. Oh, here we have Tick, guys. We're going to be telling you the best skin for Tick, even though he only has one skin. R.I.P. Tick. Tick's best skin recently came out. It is called King Crab Tick. It's really awesome, and I really think its effects definitely make it an awesome skin. Worth 80 gems, guys. If you're going to be buying that skin from the shop, use code Lex. He has seven kids, and he needs the support. Next brawler is going to be 8-Bit. Another robot, guys. 8-Bit's best skin is definitely very obvious because his other one is really bad, but this one is, is also one of the best skins in the game along with Evil Gene. It is Virus 8-Bit. This skin has cool effects with this, with this green shots, and it looks really cool. And a new voice, guys. One of the best skins in the game. The next brawler is going to be Ems. She got a bunch of nerfs recently, and so she's not as good of a brawler as she used to be, but her best skin is definitely going to be True Gold Ems. This gold skin, along with a couple other gold skins, came in the new update, and it is, it is a very cool skin except no custom effects. Next brawler is going to be Primo. El Primo! 
Ha 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 ha. Eep it eep. Oh, wait, no, that's Shelly. <laughs> El Primo's best skin is going to be El Brown because it has a huge head. It looks really cute, and it has cool custom effects which is with its punches, and it's super. Next brawler is going to be Barley, the drunkest robot there is. Barley's best skin is definitely going to be Maple Barley because it has awesome shots. He, his eyes are partly closed, and he's got a nice orange beard. Next brawler is going to be Poco Loco. Sweet sound. Hey, you broke my guitar. Poco's best skin is going to be Pirate Poco. It has six shots, and it doesn't have a hat, so it looks really different and awesome on the map. Next brawler up is going to be Rosa. Her best skin is going to be Tin Can Rosa. <laughs> Psych! She doesn't have a skin. R.I.P. Rosa. Next brawler is going to be Rico, the robot of the day. Rico's best skin was debatable between King Rico and Guard Rico. But they both have cool effects, but Guard Rico has a cool voice. So Guard Rico's going to come in number one. Let's go! <laughs> Next brawler coming up is going to be Daryl. He's really an awesome brawler. So let's show you guys the best skin for him. Dumpling Daryl would definitely be the best Daryl skin, but because of Mascot Daryl and its awesome role that looks like a soccer ball, it's six shots. Like, look at these. That's so cool. It literally shoots confetti. And when it rolls, it looks exactly like a soccer ball. That's why it's definitely the best Daryl skin. Next up, we got Penny. Her best skin is going to be the Elf Penny. It's really cool. It has super awesome effects, and its turret literally is a present. Next up, we got Jackie Smacky. Jackie has one skin, Constructor Jackie. It's not very good, but there's a skin that's going to be coming August 7th called Ultra Driller Jackie, and it's very awesome. Definitely the best skin for her when it comes out. Next up, we got Carl, and his best skin is going to be Captain Carl because it has cool effects. Next up, we got Piper, the Sniper. She's got some cool skins, and her best one is going to be Cupid Piper. Next up, we got BB. BB only has one skin called Heroin BB. It's really awesome, and it has an awesome bubble that has cool effects. Coming right up, we have Pam, the witness to the thickness. Pam's best skin is going to be Summer Pam. She only has one skin, which is that. Has some cool effects, and it's definitely her best skin. Next up, we got Bia. She only has one skin, which is Ladybug B. It's really bad, and it's only 30 gems, no custom effects. But she has one coming that's really good. It's called Mega Beetle B, and it's definitely one of my favorites. It's the best skin for Bia, by far. Next up, we got Frank, and he is definitely the tank. We're going to be telling you guys the best skin for him. Frank's best skin is going to be DJ Frank because it's not ugly like Caveman Frank. Next up, we got Nani, the last epic. She does not have a skin right now, but coming soon, she has a cool skin called Retro Nani. No custom effects, but 30 gems. Next up, we got Mortis, the creature of the night. The creature of the night. Mortis's best skin is definitely going to be Rogue Mortis. An awesome skin with custom voice, custom super, custom shots, and... It's just overall a very amazing skin. Next up, we got Tara. Her best skin is going to be Street Ninja Tara. It is very OG. Coming right up, we got Gene. His best skin is going to be Evil Gene. Definitely the best skin in the game right now, voted by almost all the pros in the game. Next is Max. Her best skin is going to be Streetwear Max. It came in the new update with Surge, and her other skin is not very good. Next up, we got Mr. P. <laughs> his best skin is going to be Agent P. It's his only skin, though. Feels bad. Next up, we got Sprout. Probably one of the most annoying brawlers in the game. She only has one skin, and it is Tropical Sprout. No custom effects, but it's got a cool jacket, and he's got the swag mode. On to the legendaries. We have Spike, and his best skin is going to be the pink Spike, um, and it is just an awesome skin. Next up, we got Crow. Sleeping with the fishes. I always get my mock. When I mock, Crow's best skin is going to be Phoenix Crow because it has one of the coolest effects in the game with its awesome gold poison. Next, we got Leon, and his best skin is going to be Werewolf Leon. Next up, we got Sandy, and his best skin is going to be the blue pajama Sandy. It's literally 500 star points in the shop, and it's not very good. 
On to the last rarity, Chromatic. We have Gale, and his best skin is going to be Merchant Gale, his only skin. On to the last and newest brawler in the game, Surge. He only has one skin, but it's very cool. It is Mecha Paladin Surge. You can get that in the Brawl Pass. That'll be it for the video, guys. Peace out. And also, don't forget to subscribe. Our channel is literally failing.